But I remember the B-17 well. It was f the flying fortress in those days. Only on two, local veterans reconnect with an American symbol of strength from World War II. An historic B-17 plane from the greatest generation landed in Tulsa today before offering vets a scenic view of the city. Two Works you reporter Megan Allison joined them on the flight to show us what veterans can enjoy throughout this week. The Texas Raiders is a B-17 built during World War II. The bomber plane and Jack Wells have a few things in common. Both joined the war in the mid-1940s, did not see combat, and enlisted with the Navy. I enlisted in, uh, in initially in the Naval Flight Training Program, and I have a crooked arm that was broken at birth. Anyhow, uh, it, it, uh, I flunked the physical, so to speak, and so I enlisted in the uh, surface Navy. But Wells tells us he's always felt a connection with aviation and these historic airplanes. When one was shot down, we had 10 guys. And, and I remember one raid with 60 planes lost. And I, I, I just, you know, almost cried. For almost 50 years, this plane has existed to connect people to an important piece of history. And for veterans, the legacy they leave behind. We've had a couple of them tear up, but just because it brings back just the emotions that it brings back. And yeah, it's pretty powerful to see that. John Bixby flies the Texas Raiders plane from city to city, giving free flights to World War II veterans. He'll be in Tulsa through Thursday and says this bomber holds a place in his heart as well. I first saw this airplane at an air show when I was 12 years old. 35 years later, I get to fly it. So it's, it, but it's just, it's just a great experience to be able to take it to various cities, show, show it around, uh, have the vets come out to see it, take them up for a ride. The commemorative Air Force will offer flights at Richard Lloyd Airport until Thursday night. If you're not a veteran, there is a fee. For more information, just go to KJRH.com. Reporting in Jinx, Megan Allison, two works for you.